What's going on YouTube? Geosnow right here. So in today's video, I have great news for those of you having older devices like the iPhone 6, 6 Plus, iPhone 5S or the iPod Touch 6th generation. Finally, I have updated files out to work without a jailbreak on your device. So you are able to edit and browse the file system to modify applications, import your music and all that jazz. So just a few hours ago, I released it on Twitter. I said that this is pretty much GeoFalza or Falza no jailbreak for the A7 to A12 devices running on iOS 12.0 all the way up to iOS 12.1.2. Now it's important to keep in mind that this is pretty much using ThinkStars exploit which is a little bit flaky on some devices. For example it crashes a lot on the iPod Touch 6th generation and the iPhone 5s but it works perfectly fine on the iPhone 6 and the 6 Plus. Don't get me wrong it works on the 5s and the iPod Touch but you may get more reboots than normal. If it reboots your device when you're trying to open Falza you're going to have to try again after the reboot because this means that the exploit failed. Shortly after that I posted a new update which pretty much fixes the success rate for the iPad Pro and the iPhone 10. So if you've been having problems with these devices there you go it's now fixed thanks to Clarity Triple Z. So if you go ahead and here on GitHub you can download the uh, files which are in IPA format and you can sideload them to the device. Please do read the logs in here these are very important and also do not get it from a signing service it will crash it's not going to work. I'm not entirely sure what makes it crash on a signing service but the only tried and true way for the moment is to sideload it with CDI Impactor on a computer. Both Windows and Linux work fine and macOS as well. So any of the IPAs in here are actually up to date. The reason there are free in here is because initially it was called GeoFalza, then GeoFalza A12 and now GeoFalza Universal but it's all the same thing. However I kept the old names as well because otherwise the uh, older links would have been broken. So so yeah, I wanted to maintain the old links as well. So yeah, in order to get it, you have to press in here, for example, get the universal one for the A7, press download in here, and you will get the IPA file. As you can see, it starts in there. And then of course, you can get the CDI Impactor from here for Mac OS, Windows, or Linux. And I'm going to show you how to sideload it with that. All right, so you have to open the CDI Impactor, which looks like this, take the IPA file and drop it in here. And now you're going to have to sign in with your Apple ID and password in order to sign the file. So I'm going to be right back in a few seconds. Of course you need a device connected to the computer before you're going to be able to sideload. Alright so here is the uh, device after sideloading but as you can see I cannot open it for the moment. It says untrusted developer. So we have to go here to settings to general and then of course scroll down to profiles and of course open it in here. Press the email account and of course press trust and in this case it will start. Now as I said in my earlier videos no matter on what device you are when it starts it will stay on a white screen for a few seconds and the reason for that is because it runs the exploit. So I'm going to run it right now and once the exploit finishes you would be able to pretty much run Falza normally. Now at this point if it crashes and it restarts your phone it's because the exploit failed and that is often the case with the uh, A7 devices but on the new newer devices it does work very fine. So as you can see it now works and I'm able to browse the files in here and I'm able to create files if I want to and all that jazz. So I press more in here, create a new file and let's just give it a name in here. So we're going to press in here and there you go. So you do have write access to var and read access anywhere. Now if you run uncover on the supported iOS 12 devices and it remounts you will be able to use the remount as well and write anywhere in the system. So yeah, that's pretty much it guys. Guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to stay updated. I am Geo Snow. Until the next time, peace out.